What's happening? Hey, what's up? What's up? Hey, what's happening? Hey, what's up? What's up? Hey, 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 what's happening, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's Nefertiti, and I'm back with another video. And I'm back with another video. Hey, hey. What's going on, y'all? Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, come on in, y'all. What's up? How you doing? If you're already subscribed, come on back. Welcome back. Hey, okay? Uh-huh. Listen, I want to talk to y'all today. I'm always talking to y'all, but I'm going to talk to y'all again because I want to. Just listen. So, have you ever realized, like, or have you ever thought, man, I just want to hear God's voice. I can't hear him. I don't know what he's saying to me. I don't know which way to go. I am confused. I need some guidance. I learned, this is something that I learned because this message is for both of us, that getting in the presence of the Lord, that's when you really can hear him and that's when he reveals things to you and that's when he pours into you, right? So when you're worshiping God, so you put on some gospel music and you just begin to worship God or maybe... You make your own music. You can sing your own song. But, you know, worship God from your heart. And you're just thanking God for things that he does for you and for being so awesome. And you're worshiping God. And you're praying. And you're reading your Bible. That's when God downloads into you. He's really pouring into you when you're taking the time to just spend time with him. You know? And how you'll know that God is downloading into you is because, like, you might be worshiping God, right? And a thought will come to your head and will give you revelation about why things ain't going right. Well, oh, dang, I realize now I see why, you know, that job didn't work out. You know, you'll have thoughts in your head. You'll, he'll put thoughts in your head. He'll even give you a word. He'll speak to you. If you take the time to be quiet and listen, he'll give you a word. And you know it comes from him because it's peaceful. And, and how how you know it's a uh, God is because you'll be at peace. He'll give it's a it's a it's a still voice, and you'll be at peace. And he'll give you words of wisdom. He's not always going to give you words that you want to hear. He's not always going to tell you what you want to hear, but he'll tell you exactly what you need to hear. And he'll give you revelation, and he'll give you insight. You'll just have knowledge. You'll just realize, like you'll just have epiphanies. Like oh my gosh, I realize that. Oh, this is what I need to do now. Okay, I realize I need to start writing down my, my schedule and making sure that I stay stick to that. You know, he will pour into you. I remember just the other day, you know, I was asking God, what do you want me to tell your people? Every time I, I, I come on here, I always pray and ask God, give me your word. What do you want me to tell your people? And he gave me a, um, a word to give you guys, and I haven't even spoken it yet, but I could not for the life of me. Like, I had nothing to say about this topic. And there are times where God will have me do research, okay? Do research about certain topics so that way I'm able to break it down in a way that you guys can understand it. And I was doing research, but I wasn't finding videos or like, I, I still have to do more research, but I wasn't finding videos that was really talking about this topic that he put in my heart. And I just was like, oh, okay, whatever. And I, you know, I had to work, I was working and stuff like that. So I wasn't really... I was reading my Bible and stuff, but I wasn't really sitting in his presence. I wasn't really just taking the time to just worship God and just sit in his presence and letting him download into me. So I wasn't getting nothing. I wasn't getting nothing. I just didn't, I didn't know what to say for like days. I didn't have nothing to say because I didn't know what to say. But the moment that I took the time to get in his presence, when I was able to, when I was sitting and worshiping him and I was praying and you know just writing things down that's when he poured into me but when I worshiped him is when he really was pouring into me so I'm just sitting there worshiping God or whatever and then his Holy Spirit just starts to pour into me and he's revealing things to me and he's revealing to me you know giving me words he's downloading words into me like just like pouring them into me and even when you're reading the Bible you can be reading you know God will lead you to a certain part of the Bible or maybe you're just reading a certain part of the Bible and It'll be uh, one little story that po that points out to you. It just keeps on, it's like magnifying, like a sore thumb. It just sticks out like a sore thumb. That may be God speaking to you about something, speaking to you about a thing. You know, um, yesterday I was real frustrated. I was real upset, you know, because there's some things that I'm going through. And I'm just like, God, what the heck? Like, when when you're going to lift your hand up off this thing? I need help. Help me. Jesus. Jesus. I was frustrated. And, um... I opened up my Bible. He told me to open up my Bible. And literally, he took me. I literally, when I opened it up, it was a part of the scripture that I highlighted a while ago. And it was the very thing that I, I needed to hear at that moment. And so, when you take the time to read your Bible, 
when you take the time and just pray, or not even, not even, even when you're not praying, just talk to God and just listen, just be quiet, just be peaceful, even get a piece of paper and write down some things, you know, write down what you hear. When you take the time to get in God's presence is when he'll pour into you. So if you feel like you're, you're stuck, if you're a content creator, if you are a speaker, whatever it is, if you are, if you're walking with Christ and you are, you know, in the front lines and you're in the headlights and you're on, you know, you're, if you're on TV, if you're on the internet, you know, whatever God has you in front. It's so important that you stay in his presence. You have to stay in his presence because that's how you'll know how to maneuver. That's how you know how to go about certain situations is because he will reveal it to you. But you have to spend time with him. You can't just like, you know, okay, I love God. Maybe read a scripture here and there and just go about your life the whole, no, you, you need to get in his presence. Like you need to really like spend that time with him, sit with him, worship with him and pray with him and let God and he'll download into you. But you also, when you, when you want to hear from God and you want him to pour into you, just say a prayer and ask God to give you a receptive heart, an understanding heart. Ask him to give you insight, reveal to you what he's trying to say. And a lot of times God speaks in so many different ways. He's just an awesome God. He, he speaks in so many different ways. God will speak to me like, like I'm speaking. He will speak to me with giving me nudges. He will speak to me with giving me a feeling to go do something. He will speak to me by, I'll go on YouTube and a message will pop up and it'll be exactly what I need to hear. You know, so I'm just letting you know today, get in his presence, get in God's presence and just take your time and bask in his presence, worship, sing worship music, you know, write some things down, read your Bible and let him pour into you. He's, he wants to speak to you. He's always speaking. But when you don't know how he's speaking, ask God, Lord, reveal to me how you speak. Reveal to me when you're speaking to me about a thing in my life. Help me to understand that it's you. Show me that it's you. Give me a confirmation. Sometimes we have to do that so that we know it's God. So we're sure it's God and it's not no evil spirit. All right? Listen, God bless y'all. I, I, God bless y'all. If you guys got this far, thank you so much for watching this video. If it's on your heart, please share it to somebody who you know, who you know needs to hear it. And be sure to subscribe to the channel. And also, subscribe to my reaction channel. All right? I love you guys. God bless y'all. Stay tuned.